Welcome to the Windows and Computer channel and um, I want to talk about something that a lot of you see that you might be able to do something about and it's a message that pops up in the settings for some of you um, and I've heard a lot of people say that they see it on their machines uh, like the one you see here which is some settings are managed by your organization and so you might wonder why is it like that? Now, this is a normal message if you are connected on a domain, if you have an enterprise ver version and actually have to log into a domain for the business you work for or the company you work for. Some of the settings might be managed by the enterprise. Uh, if it's a enterprise PC that your company give, gave you or uh, sent you for working from home, once again, this message is probably normal because some of the settings will be actually managed by the company you work for. But if it's a regular PC that you just use at home, nothing fancy, nothing special, and you go into some of the settings and you see this, then um, this is simply a registry uh, setting that you have. It doesn't change anything, honestly. There are no settings that you will change that will possibly uh, n not work. So it's more of a message that's there but doesn't really do anything. So even if it's there, it's kind of who cares because it doesn't prevent any settings from being managed by yourself. But still, you want this to go away, there's a, a way to do it with the registry editor. So what you'll do is, um, of course, start the registry editor. You can do it by going to uh, the search and typing reg edit, which will bring you to the registry editor. The other way you can do it is with the uh, Windows key and R. And here you can type reg edit, press enter, and yes. What you want to do is go into H key current user and expand it. Then expand software. Then you will expand policies. Then you will expand Microsoft, Windows, current version. Now I don't have it here, but you if you have that message, you should see here in the expansion, push notifications. You'll expand push notifications um, in the right side. You will have no toast application notifications. What you want to do is double click on that. So when you have some uh, information in a, re a registry value and stuff, you will double click on it and you see you can actually add or change values. By default, the value that I am talking about, which is the uh, value of, once again, something called no toast application notification. You double click and the value, you'll actually enter zero to make sure that um, it is zero. So one is the default value but you will actually put zero and click the OK button. You will restart your computer. And normally, after a restart, your computer should not have that message display anymore. You might need to sign out of your Microsoft account and sign in again for it to be complete. So if it still shows after a restart, sign out of your Microsoft account, sign back in. And normally all of that should disappear and you should have a normal settings app that does not have any of the uh, things that we just talked about, which is, uh, you know, uh, some settings managed by the organization. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us a thumbs up. Thank you for watching.